Hello there again, everyone. My name is JY8559, and I am a support team member here on DeepBot. And I am going to show you guys how to import commands via the command, uh, channel commands tab. So what you want to do is, is you want to make sure that you have a JSON file or a JSON uh, script that is compatible with DeepBot. Now, uh, <clears throat> there are already some JSONs for the uh, mini games that we have uh, made by me and the lollipops. Um, now, what you want to do is, for example, you want to go to custom mini games. Okay. Now, let's say, for example, lollipops. Uh, let's find one that's got a JSON file. Okay, coin flip. I've already got one, so I'm not going to do that one. I've already got a coin flip command. Okay, defuse a bomb. I do not have this command. So I will uh, click on download JSON. And then it brings up the text file that you need to copy. Now what you will do, after I scroll all the way back to the top, what you will do is you will... Uh, left click and hold and select the entire all of the text all the way from top to bottom and then you'll copy either with control C or right click and select copy then you'll go to your channel commands tab and you'll right click import command and paste and that is how you will import a command then you'll click OK. You'll get a little text box up here saying you're about to import 14 commands, which is how many commands is in the diffuse. Custom commands are powerful in nature and are able to save files or folders in your PC. Please ensure you trust the source of these commands before continuing. Are you sure? You'll click yes. And as you can see, right there is the diffuse the bomb command. And everything is already set up. Basically, if it's already been grouped, it will automatically put it in the group and then it will also set everything you need for example user elevated the other ones are mod only user elevated hide from command list and that is how you import commands via a JSON file please make sure that you do not import a JSON file that is not compatible because if you do it will cause the bot to crash um, because it does take a certain script to do this so basically make sure you only get them from the wiki or if someone is team view uh, team viewer using your computer using team viewer doing I can't talk right <laughs> um, basically controlling your computer via team viewer or trying to import a import a command for you that they have done Basically, make sure you only use those JSONs. I would really appreciate it. And uh, if this video was helpful or you liked it, please uh, give it a like on YouTube. I really would appreciate it. And I hope all of you have a nice afternoon or day, whichever it may be for you guys. And we'll see you in my next video.